Hi, Curlis. Welcome to Barbie Monday. I'm Soul Child 67, aka Betty. Not showing myself today. Curlis, I look a hot mess. It's been a whirlwind weekend. It is Tuesday. So you're getting Barbie Monday on Tuesday. Whoo, shy. My days are running together. <laughs> Plus, my voice, my voice is like, ugh, it's shot. But anyway, these are the new Barbies. Well, this one is not new. This is the Holiday Barbie 1994. I've had her for a while. And yes, she is out of the box because she was out of the box at my parents' house. I did that. Um, if you see this one right here, my sissy poo gave her to me. Uh, I think a couple years ago, my bestie gave her to me, but when I re- uh, when I downsized, I sold the one I had and she does not have the hand muffs that come with her. Uh, so I'm a little, you know, sad about that. But I did it to myself by getting rid of her the first time when I had her. She is a consignment Barbie, my sister told me, that she uh, originally bought for her granddaughter and the granddaughter just never really opened her. So... The box was a little damaged and I took her out. Um, she is a special edition holiday Barbie. I'm looking for the year so that I can tell you the year that she is. Um, let's see. Wow, is her year on here? I don't see her year on the box which is unusual. Maybe she's on the top part. I'm sorry. <laughs> Just glance at the other Barbies. Whatever. Yeah, I don't see her year. Um, yeah, I wish I, I wish I knew her year, but if you take a look at the one in the back, I just got that one from Amazon. She's the 2019 holiday Barbie. Uh, I'm a little behind on the Holiday Barbies because uh, being that they are collectors, the prices are being bumped up on some of them, but I was able to find the 2019 Barbie on Amazon for $23, so I was happy about that. I don't know if she was very popular because I've read on a lot of Barbie blogs, a lot of people didn't like the 2019 um, dress. Uh, I love it. It's a holiday Barbie. It's Christmas. It's got the candy cane stripes. I'll move in so you can see her face. Lovely face, lovely smile. I love the pose, the hair. That is the good thing about leaving the holiday Barbies in the box. You still get that original pose because they are tied into the box. But as I said before, this 1994, I think, holiday Barbie was when I was at my parents' house and I was so excited I took her out of the box. <laughs> and she has the old type stand, as you can see, that says Happy Holidays. Um, this Barbie right here, I cannot find the year on the box. I'm still looking. I wish I could, because I would like to know what year she was. Hmm. 1996. So there you have it. She's 1996. So, so she, <laughs> they both, the ones in the gold have some age on them. And I should have known they were early 90s by the style of their holiday gowns, as you can see. So you have 94 and 1996. And then 2019. So, and I should tell you, uh, the cool thing about when Mattel does these holiday Barbies, they also create the holiday Barbie Christmas ornament. Those are miniature and you can hang them on the tree. So, and this is the original box she came out of. As you can see, it was a little damaged. Um, even though it said never removed from box, my sister did get it on consignment, and so whoever had it before dropping it off at consignment, obviously the child played with it, probably didn't like it, and the hand muff is the only part that I'm missing. 
As you can see, her hands are free here. So, and I'm cool with that. You know, sometimes you can find these smaller accessories on Etsy that match it or something, but I don't really think she needs it. Her hands aren't that cold. <laughs> Not in North Carolina anyway. <laughs> and of course the other Barbie, you know me, your girl gonna always drop something while doing a video. And of course the other Barbies remain the same. Uh, I'm still thinking about how I'm going to do uh, a case, whether to get another one of these from, um, oh my gosh, Ikea. <laughs> but I would have to move the hubby's wine sign and put one here. And then I would like to put a big one along this wall, just one big case. Uh, a part of me was hoping I could go up and do a case with glass, but then I wouldn't have enough room. But I could do a floor to ceiling type case if I if I went to a furniture store and got that type of thing. But I like Ikea's prices on this type of case. This type of case is easier for me to put together, but it would limit me because then I need a whole bunch of these cases. Um, they do tell you when you put these cases together not to put anything up here, but these Barbies are so light, uh, you know, in weight, so I have them up there. So, And that's another thing, trying to figure out how to display Barbies that are in a case. I mean, that are in a box. So my Barbies that are out will probably be inside of a case. My Barbies that are in a box, I was thinking maybe I could go up top there and just put regular shelving uh, along the wall to display them and kind of turn them sideways. So you would only have a side view if you walked into the room, but I know who, you know what they were, what they are. So the side view would just kind of be like that, you know what I mean? and you would still see the face. So I haven't decided yet. Um, I don't want my collection to get over 300 because then we're gonna run into an issue. <laughs> so I think what I will do now is try to backtrack and get my hands on some more holiday Barbies and then only buy Barbies that I really, really like, uh, which is what I did with these Barbie, Barbie extras. They are the dolls. I really, really love the Barbie extras. There are some more coming out um, so I'm hoping I can get some type of risers and rise those ones in the back and then rise these and then put the new ones in the front because I have room in here. You can get at least 14 dolls if you have risers. I've seen people do that. Um, a lot of problems, a lot of times the problem will actually be these, um, the base to the doll stands are wide. Same thing with the wheelchair, Barbie. That base is really wide. I didn't have to put her ramp in there, but I chose to do that. So, so yeah, instead of a Barbie Monday, you got a Barbie Tuesday. Nothing else is new. I'm looking behind me trying to make sure nothing else is new. So the only things new here are, of course, her and her. She came yesterday, so yes, from Amazon for $23, so I was lucky about that because a lot of you guys have reached out to me about Amazon and, and, and you know, consignment in different places. So yes, Amazon does have some of the older holiday Barbies. Uh, I did see where a couple of people were selling her for 60 bucks. I was like, what? <laughs> and this one that my sissy gave me, I've seen where the white one is going for $1,000. I'm like, oh my God. So shout out to my sissy K and shout out to my Nisi Poo Trinity, thank you so much. I love you guys so much. So anyway, I'm gonna get out of here and have me some hot tea or something because my voice is trying to go. <laughs> so hopefully, yes, I hopefully I will have a video for you guys on Wednesday. I'll probably shoot something tonight. I don't know what the content is going to be, but I'm on a roll, so let's keep this ball going. <laughs> <laughs> okay, have a happy Tuesday. It's Barbie Tuesday. Yeah. Okay, Curlies. Don't forget to comment, like, subscribe. And of course, we always talk in the comment section. Bye. P.S. Curlies, just wanted to come back and show you something. Um, I took part of the box off, that hard part. If you can see that gold part that's right here and put the Barbies on there and it, it gave them a little bit of height. Not much, but it gave them a little bit of height. <laughs> don't ask me why I decided to try that, but it worked. So I don't know, maybe I can find something else. 
um, to use as a riser for them. I'm going to still keep searching though, but yeah, just wanted to come back and show you that. I can show you what that, what it was too. It's this off the bottom of the box. I took that off the top of the box and yeah, it's not quite high enough, but it did give a little bit of height to the Barbies to see the ones in the back. Okay, I'm out for real this time.